Okay, here we are, Matthew Russell Lee, Inner City Press, here at the Southern District of New York Courthouse. Tuesday, March 29th, 2022. We're back for more of the U.S. versus Larry Ray. Things may be coming to a close. Yesterday it was said that the government may rest its case Thursday or Friday, so this horror show may soon be over. What the outcome for Larry Ray will be, we'll have to see. Now today, uh, victim witness Felicia Rosario is set to testify. There's going to be something about the DNC, the Democratic National Committee in uh, North Carolina. See, Talia Ray, the daughter of Larry Ray, was working there, and it seems that there's some prostitution proceeds from Claudia Drury that somehow went down there via Felicia Rosario. That's my understanding. I'll have to, I'll be live tweeting it. You can find out. Now, in other news, John List gone. Um, there's a certain current administration diplomat uh, much lauded uh, in the New York Times that, that uh, seems to be a client. Let's just put it that way. Check it out. Check it out. Across the river in the EDNY, also moving toward, quite moving toward endgame, Roger Eng trial, that is to say JOLO, which is to say one MBD. Uh-oh, a scandal, kind of like Scotty David here in the SDNY. A juror, albeit an alternate juror, belatedly disclosing that he failed to disclose on his jury questionnaire that he was an extra in The Wolf of Wall Street. Does it matter? Well, the money stolen from the Malaysians went to fund The Wolf of Wall Street and, in fact, was forfeited back. So, in the way that the UN has never returned the money, did you know that UN affiliates took money from Malaysians and have kept it? And have said it was only three million, only criminals, thieves, and losers, because not only have they failed the Ukrainians time after time, a full month of failure, but yesterday, Antonio Guterres, the censor, the secretary general, the corrupt one who will throw out the press to conceal his links to Chinese bribers, took over the day, canceled the noon briefing, canceled the press conference about the uh, commission on the status of women to announce that, yes, Martin Griffith, his humanitarian official taken from the UK, will take charge in Ukraine. We'll see. Don't count on it. The UN is failing and we must be restored to access to report it in greater detail. Finished.